What's up y'all? It's Jordan here. Welcome and or welcome back to my channel. I am back with another video for you guys and actually another Shein haul as you can tell by the title. I'm really supposed to be in Puerto Rico right now but the weather was really bad in Houston where I was flying out of so my flight ended up getting canceled but no worries. I already rebooked my trip for later on during the summer and so I bought a bunch of vacation clothes from Shein so I decided I'm just going to show you guys what I got and like always everything will link down below but before we get started guys don't forget to hit that red subscribe button so you can be a part of the Jordan Johnson media fam and then also hit that notification bell so you can be notified every single time that I upload let's go ahead and roll that intro So let's go ahead and get started off with accessories. So I got two purses, both very vacation vibes. So the first one is this little straw purse. And as you can see, it's very you know structured. It has these little handles. This is gonna be so cute when I actually am able to go to Puerto Rico. It has the um, a little crossbody, strap to match and it's detachable so you can easily like take it off but this is just really nice quality the inside it's pretty spacious and it's lined there's no pockets or anything on the inside but it's really just like that perfect vacation bag um going out to dinner going out to lunch super cute and you know it's vacation vibes okay so the next bag that i got is really just the ideal beach bag you can see it's just it's this tan color i don't even know it's like a woven material and this is just like perfect for the beach throw your towel in here some sunglasses some like a tumbler or drink or anything like that you just throw it over your shoulder and it's actually very spacious and it is pretty stretchy as well um i'm like i said i'm gonna link everything down below so be sure to check out these items and i'll have the pricing and everything like that you could just click the link and go straight to the shein website and then the inside like there's no pockets or anything like that it's just an open bag okay next we can move on the shoes so first pair of shoes this is probably like i haven't had like a necessary like fail from shein in a while because i've been ordering from them for like the past five seven six seven, around that time a very long time but i ordered these black sandals that are really really cute but guys they sent me two left feet literally two left sandals and i already contacted them and they're sending me the um a brand new pair but yeah i just have like these two left sandals and these sandals are actually really cute and they seem to be you know pretty sturdy and like nice material and like actually nice sandals so can't wait for them to actually send me the a pair that I can actually wear these next pair of sandals are tan and these are like a very very cheap material like I would not wear these just out normally these are purely like beach sandals because like I said they're very like flimsy material um they have a little toe strap and they have some leather straps on here but like I don't know if you could tell, like, it's just really flimsy. You can see, like, how thin it is. Um, but they do fit, and they are, like, like I said, I'd wear them on the beach or something like that. So they're pretty good, and they were, I don't remember the exact price right now, but they're pretty cheap. So, uh, yeah, good for vacation. Okay, and the last pair of shoes I have are these wedges with a clear strap. I actually accidentally ordered two pairs of these. Silly me. But these are just so, so cute. And I love them. There's summertime vibes, vacation vibes. You know, we love like a, a cork wedge. And then the fact that it just has the, the clear straps on top, like it's really cute. These are actually pretty sturdy and pretty, um, like they seem pretty durable. So I'm excited to pair a fit with these. Okay, and then the last accessory I'm going to show you guys, I forgot this actually isn't from Shein, but I'll link it down below if you guys want me to, but is this beach hat, and this is actually from Amazon. Um, I have a headband on, but like still, that's really cute, and it has a little 
bow in the back so i'll definitely be linking the uh this it's from amazon like i said but too cute to just not to mention and it was part of my you know puerto rico packing all that stuff so i did forget i actually do have one more accessory from shein to show you guys and it is these sunglasses kind of like messing up with my headband there we go um, if you follow me on social media, which you definitely should, my Instagram is just Jordan or is Jordan Johnson Media. My Twitter is underscore just Jordy Two Wise. Also, that's my TikTok, always linked down below. But if you saw like my graduation weekend celebration, I had on these glasses like every single day, and they're just so cute. Like I love the little cat eye, and I was wearing them like on my head. Like these are so so cute and they're from Shein so you know don't know the exact price but definitely affordable so yeah and I'm just not like a huge sunglass person like I will lose sunglasses so I've never really been to like super expensive ones I'll take some from Target take some from Shein call it a day um and so I really like to go to Shein for shades because I'm irresponsible and so if I lose these it's okay because I can order a new pair because they're very affordable but let's go ahead and get into some clothes okay so I do have quite a few swimsuits but I'm just going to do those last because I already have this on y'all I am in love with this so basically it's just a you know a beachy time sundress the details you can see it has the chain right here on both sides for the straps and then you tie it in the back and this also has like a zipper right here this is a size extra small it goes all the way down you're not gonna be able to see it but i will do some b-roll footage so y'all can actually see the full length but it has a little slit down the side and this is just real cute real beach vacation vibes like paired with those wedge um those yeah those wedges and like if this isn't vacation vibes i don't know what is like this is it's comfortable the material is comfortable it's lightweight it's cute it's affordable i highly recommend i would give this a 10 out of 10 and yeah this was just imagine you are just on the beach with your boo like this is one of those fits highly recommend next we have this beautiful two-piece set as you can see it comes with the um off the shoulder top and then the pants are these are i'm definitely gonna have to get them hemmed but they are just like wide leg pants they are a bit see-through as you can see like you, there's pockets and you can actually see the pockets through the pants but this is just so beautiful y'all um it's in a size extra small everything is in a size extra small or a, if it if they offer extra small i will get it in extra small but um some things may be a small i'll try to remember to specify what is and what isn't but this is definitely an extra small and it's so like the color y'all i'm gonna go back and see if they have different colors because this is cute it's so it's giving me springtime summertime I probably need to have a photo shoot in this outfit y'all are probably gonna must definitely see some Instagram pics in this like okay maybe not with that maybe not I was I got a little overzealous but this is such a cute outfit y'all the material is you know it's kind of thin um like you can hear it. it's like a little bit of a windbreaker material but i think that's going to be okay for the texas summer um because it's going to keep me cool it's not too hot it does so it zips on the side and in the back of the pants it does have like an elastic so um it fits my waist very very nice um if you're new here i'm only 4'11 and so if you are about you know maybe like 5'4 these pants will probably fit you um pretty well but if you're anything shorter than that you're probably gonna have to get them hemmed um i weigh about like 108 pounds i'm between like a size four and like a size two in dresses usually an extra small 
But yes, I love this y'all. Y'all have to get this so we can twin because it's so cute. Literally, this gets another 10 out of 10. We're doing good, Shein, we're doing good. Okay, next we have another two piece set. So in this one, the pants are a little bit too big. As you can tell, like they sit like right at my belly button, but I prefer to them be high waisted and sit like right there. So that's nothing a little, you know, adding a little bit of elastic won't fix. And then the top, actually you can tie it whatever you, way you want. So it's just one of those like comes literally just like a piece of fabric. So I tied it this way because I've been loving these styles of tops. But um, the model on the website, she had it on um, just like in a, like a bandeau top tied in the front. But in the pants, I really like this color. It's a very nice. Um, I think it'll be a really good transition into the fall, especially here in Texas. It's not going to, it's still going to be warm through um, like all of August, September, and like a little bit of October as well. So I think this outfit could easily transition to the fall. It has pleats on the top of the pants and then they're just wide leg and then the back i mean i just have it tied like that so there's a lot of fabric so you can even you know like well i couldn't you can tie it different ways wrap it how, however you want um but this is really cute i i definitely it's just like the fit is a little bit off the material is really nice the clothes really nice so i have to get this one like a eight and a half out of ten because um, yes, they're a little bit too long, but like that's normal because even with the other thing I gave it 10 out of 10, it, it was still too long. But it's just the waist on the pants. I know I'm going to have to either safety pin it or like add some elastic into it or something like that. So this one gets an 8.5 out of 10 for me. Okay, next we have this crochet top and some denim shorts. So the crochet top, it actually fits. I just don't have it tied all the way because I didn't feel like doing all that but this is such a cute casual outfit like if you're just like going on a hike maybe or just doing more like outdoors activity sorry this is coming untied because I barely tied it but I really like the pattern and the colors and it's not see-through like it's really cute and you can even like so I tied it in the back you can like do a little bow in the front that would be really cute something like that like and it just ties in the back and it has you know ignore like my scratches on my back but um yeah and it has the little tassels that hang down it's you know it's just cute and um casual and i like the bright colors so and it's not itchy i know one thing about sometimes when things are knit or like crocheted or anything like that they can be itchy but this isn't itchy at all and then as for the shorts they're just you know some regular shorts um they are like very relaxed fit like loose so i would not wear these like out or anything like that like out um so if i was going to like a party or like the anything like that like casual but like going out somewhere i wouldn't wear these these are like super casual like beach day, running errands, stuff like that, because they don't really um, do anything for uh, my shape or the lack thereof. Like, it's just like really loose fit, relaxed fit. So it's just cute for like a, a day, um, like just like a day out, um, being outside, if you're going like, like I said, on a hike, if you're on vacation, or if you're just like running errands, or just something like chill something chill not too um like dressy cute these are a little bit big on my waist but nothing you know a belt won't fix fix um these are a size i don't really know i don't know what size their their pants come in i think it's maybe like an extra small or small or a two something like that but i'll have it all down below but yes they're just Really casual, all the pockets are real. Yep. So I give this whole thing, I give the top a nine out of 10 because I really, really, really like it, but I don't love it as much as the other pieces I gave 10 out of 10. And I give the shorts like a seven out of 10. They're just, you know, basic shorts and they could fit better, but yeah, what you gonna do? 
Okay, so this next outfit is just some biker shorts and then this like woven top. So the biker shorts are from Shein, but I'm not gonna go in depth on them. They're just, you know, your basic spandex bike shorts, but I'll link them down below. This shirt had a lot of potential, but it's just not, it's not given what it was supposed to be gave. Like the neck string is too tight, but when I loosen it, y'all can see like my boob is about to come out. Like it's about to spill out. And so I just feel like it should have, they should have made this part more like this. <clears throat> they should have yeah like this is too much fabric up here and it's making it to where like my boob is almost hanging out and I don't really like that so I'm looking in the viewfinder it's just because gotta make sure they stay in and it just ties in the back with just like one little string I just feel like it was poorly made like it was a cute concept I can maybe try to finesse it a little bit but I'm not trying to be like, you know, like self-conscious, like all night, just like pulling it up because realistically, like the thickest part, this like where the corners meet, the thickest part should have been where my boobs are. Instead, it's like this really thin part right here. And so that's kind of annoying. So this gets like a four out of 10 for me because I don't know how I'm going to be able to wear it. So, okay, up next, we have this cream off-white one piece rib one piece and y'all this is it it's i got a size extra small it's actually a little too small y'all like it's low-key like suffocating my thighs so i'm kind of scared about when i wash it but it's just so cute my idea now that i think about it that probably wouldn't have been a good idea but my idea for this was like like atv and i like horseback riding but since it's white probably not the best idea but it is, you know, it's just sleeveless, shorts. I'm really into these one-piece rompers lately because I am lazy. And then you could zip it all the way up if you want to. It's a little tight when I zip it all the way up. So you gotta let the little cleavage that I do have, I'll let that out a little bit. But um, you can see like the texture. I don't know if y'all can tell. But it is ribbed, it has a nice little collar, and it's kind of getting washed out right now, but it definitely is like an off-white cream color. And this, you could dress this up, dress it down. I could wear this with my Tory Burch sandals, which is like a casual look. I could wear this with some, um, I was going to say Air Forces, but the whites may clash. But you can wear it with some tennis shoes. You can wear this with, you know, some heels. You could put a flannel around your waist, a jean jacket on. This is really like a really universal um, staple piece that I recommend that you get. This gets, ooh, can I give it like a 9.8 out of 10? Because it's a little tight on my thighs, y'all. It's a little tight, it's not going to lie. Like if I had this on all day, I wouldn't, I don't think I'd be uncomfortable, but I think if I take it, when I take it off, I'll have like, rings around my thighs because it's a little tight but i would not size up um because like it's it's a little loose around here like it i wouldn't i don't i think a small would be too big for me so i'm happy with this size so yeah i'll give it a 9.8 and now we can go ahead and get into some swimsuit okay y'all so the first swimsuit i'm going to show you is this burnt orange one piece and it has the little ring in the middle this is just really giving me like 70s share vibes like so cute um it you know has a good amount of coverage so you know you can wear this around your family stuff like that like nothing's gonna be spilling out um the amount of cheekiness it's not super cheeky it's like well i guess for some people this is like medium cheeky to me, honestly. Cuts like right in between, but it's not like a thong or anything like that. And then it just ties in the back. As you can see, it's like completely open. So it's basically like a, a, a two piece, you just, you know, have this ring that connects you together. Only thing is, I feel like it is a little bit loose. Like there's, it's a, like my torso isn't long enough, but um, this is a size extra small. So if you're like a couple inches taller than me, like I said, I'm only like 4'11", then you'll probably be okay. But 
yeah, so I just like, I pulled these side strings up and I kind of just like, kind of do a little tuck situation to try to work that out. But yeah, I really like this swimsuit. Um, I love the color, I love the cut. And it just, it all around, it gets 10 out of 10 for me. Okay, I guess I was just feeling very nostalgic because I'm pretty sure my next swimsuit is like the same type of style kind of with the rings and everything. But the rings are just so cute. They give me very much 70s, very much Donna Summer, Cher, Diana Ross, and I love it. But this is just a really pretty green. I don't even know how to describe this type of green. Maybe like a sage green type thing because it's like kind of muted and kind of um yeah but it's like muted and pastel at the same time it's it's super cute and as you can see it has the ring detailing right here and then on the hip these are a little bit more cheeky than the one piece i just had on and i one thing i hate about some she and some suits like they fold over like that to where you can see like the white inside lining and i don't really like that but yes really cute um i really like it y'all don't mind this i have like a little i i fell the other day and so i have a little you know a little marker that's gonna go away hopefully eventually but yeah this swimsuit's so cute y'all i give this a 10 out of 10. okay and then the last thing for this haul is this swimsuit as you can see it's very similar to the other ones but also different um so it has the rings in the middle instead and it's a lot smaller and then it also has the rings right here on the hip they also tie on the hip and it's this pretty you know like it's like a cayenne type color like i get brown vibes from it but i also get like tints of red and and things like that so it's like a like a cayenne pepper but um this swimsuit does the little thing again where it has like the lining is like showing or whatever but it's whatever it's still a very very cute swimsuit it's like moderately cheeky and yeah it's really cute um all the swimsuits i got are in an extra small of course and yeah so this is all for this swimsuit Okay, y'all, that is it for this Shein haul. I really hope you enjoyed the video. Like I said, throughout the video, everything will be linked down below, so be sure to go ahead and check it out if you want to. This video is in no way sponsored. I bought all of this in my own money, pretty much buy all of my clothes from Shein, and you guys seem to really like my Shein haul, so I'm going to keep spending my money and buying clothes. But Shein, if you want to sponsor me, my DMs are always open. Um, speaking of DMs, follow me on social media. It's all linked down below. Jordan Johnson Media on Instagram. Underscore just Jordy with two Ys on Twitter and on TikTok. And thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.